Allow me to set the scene, if I will. You meet up with your friends for a hot night of tabletop role-playing games. You've got your character in mind. You want to play an exceptional wizard who commands the vast arcane powers of wizardry. But then you get there. You open the player's handbook and you realize your brain is smooth. That's the reality that faces a lot of people in the hobby. And I'm proud to say, actually, that we now have courtesy of someone on Reddit, uh, a user by the name of Dude with Tude 42 There's an RPG for the rest of us. Dungeon and Dragon. Now, in case you can't see what's happening here, this is a RPG that is, consists entirely of words that are either three letters in length or less. Um, obviously, this isn't actually an RPG for people who failed English. This is just a, a little bit of a shit post writing exercise. And I personally th thought this was quite funny and I, I wanted to share this with all of you today. So uh, we're just going to go through the rules quickly here. It's only three pages long, so it really shouldn't take us too much time. First of all, if you try to act. So if you try to act, use a die six. If the sum is nil, one or two, you do not act. If the sum is six or up, you do act the act. <laughs> you do the act in a big way. If not, you do the act as it is. Now, what can you do when you act? Well, you can do ops. Your ops is our aim, hex, aid, run, fix, lie. Uh, you can also ask, bet, bob, con, cry, dig, dry, die, eat, hum, mix, nap, sit, say, see, vi, wed, and yak, all as you see fit. Um, some some notable examples here that I want to showcase. Uh, aid is to use a med on a pal, and to run is to go far. <laughs> Lie is to say a lie, or to be a spy, and hex, see hex. Uh, by the looks of it, uh, Dungeon and Dragon uses uh, AD&D rules, so you can either choose a class or you can be uh, like a, a fancy racial class. Uh, so the kin are elf or can fey, and jobs, much like real life, are cop, whiz, and nun. Uh, each of these offering a uh, situational dice bonus to a certain act, uh, a certain op. So elf um, can fix, orc can run, fake can lie, cop can aim, uh, wiz can hex, and none can aid. But of course, you know it's an RPG. You don't just stop there. You have to describe your character. Are you new or old? Big or wee? Lax or mad? Fun or dry? Um, now, of course, it wouldn't be an RPG without, you know, some kind of combat. Uh, fortunately, this uh, game does have you covered, so a hit can be one way of six. You can cut, jab, bam, hot, icy, and zap. If you get hit by a sum of six or up, you die. All pretty straightforward. And we have some... Um, we have some sample weapons here. So, awls, axes, bow... Gun, med, net, rod, oil, and orb. Uh, and if you have an orb or you have a rod, you can hex. So you can try hex if you use a rod or an orb. You cannot hex a foe you cannot see. Uh, and again, I'm just going to showcase some of my favorites here. Uh, I like spy, which is see a bit you cannot see, and fly, you can go up. <laughs> Uh, and you know, we it wouldn't be it wouldn't be much of a rule book if we didn't have some kind of like sample inventory you can buy. Of course, the currency is yen, um, and all prices are either one, two, or six. I'm sure, in theory, your games master could also give you something that's ten yen, but that would be really expensive. Uh, and you know, we just we have some we have some samples here, so like egg ghee. We have food: egg ghee, ham, jam, rye, fig, pie. Yeah. Uh, pen, ink, mat, uh, all the clothes you would ever need, the wig, hat, cap, gi, tee, rag, bib, top and tie. Um, and of course we have a bestiary as well. So uh, you have cod, elk, owl, and eel. What else do you need? You know, I love the idea of zap eel. 
and also hex ox <laughs> yeah so this is pretty funny i really like this and uh, it actually did lead to a uh quite an interesting discussion in the on the original reddit thread where this was posted i will be sharing this um so um from Heimnuth here, we had someone that said, uh, this reminds me of an old RPG I saw once set in prehistoric times. You played a caveman and one of your stats was syllables on a scale of one to three. You only got a one, you can only speak one syllable. So a mammoth wouldn't be a mammoth. It would be a big tusk thing. And a rival tribe would be bad rock throw tree men. Uh, and the um, system in question is called Land of Og. Short, humorous role-playing games where the PCs are cavemen and worlds full of dinosaurs. When speaking in character, players are limited to a 17-word vocabulary. Um, it looks like maybe they changed that for a later edition. And you have five attributes, which are strength, brain, speed, hitting, and health. And <laughs> you have your five classes. Strong caveman, smart caveman, fast caveman, hitting caveman, and healthy caveman. So that's fun. I like that. Uh, yeah, Og Unearthed is another one. Let's see what else we got. Oh, we've got someone. Uh, they added their own expansion. So we have New Ken, Man, Bug, and Imp. And new jobs, ass, apt, and oaf. That's fun, actually. I like that. Uh, we've got someone being a pedant. I'm liking the people here who um, <laughs> who are also responding in three le letter words or less. So, uh, Sai, son of Aphrodite here, says, uh, The RPG you let us see in the dock is big fun, but I cannot can any map of PvE or net of light that all of my pal can see to. Do you own any for us to use? <laughs> I do say, the RPG you did is a joy to see. I am set by the awe of the job. Top RPG- oh, this one's cheating. Top RPG, can you do a hot hit with Hex though? Though, that's, that's like an abbreviation, that doesn't count. Same with OMG and Pog. This is V-Fun, use of bit, e.g. cannot see for a bit, is big wit. I like all the ops, but gun is OP. Um, pro, pro tip, non-dry kin are not for PCs, do not be a hex card, but non-dry kin are good NPC. I bet dungeon a lot of fun. How it go in you can up top. How far you use pen to do. For you I say, not bad at all. But how few yen do new men own? Six? Can I not buy a tin box for abs and a tin cap to nix a head? I'm in awe of yon way to toy. You did a top job. I may add a few kin and job as hot law as IGM. It has too few now. Hot law. <laughs> uh, so for those unfamiliar, hot law is a, uh, a dungeon way of saying house rule. Hot law. <laughs> Uh, new job, Kerr. If you're a spy or lie to a foe and you win, you add one to all hit you do to yon foe. Can I buy a yak to put a few bit on or a dog or a cat for the guy who hex all the day? Not bad, it's gas. Oh, someone's, uh, someone's added some map rules here. So the map play is not far, not so far, far, too far see, to and fro. The map key is Orc Dig, Old Oak, Bug Bog, Man Den, Dry Dam, Fat Man, Fat Man Den, Hot Sea, Ice Gap, and Bed Bar. Oh, the wit, wow, my joy is big. Yeah. So yeah, this was, um, this was just a fun little writing project, I think. I fully give props to Dude of Tude 42. Uh, I think if any group out there is insane enough to try and run a session in this where everyone also only speaks in three letter words or less, I would be supremely impressed. Um, but yeah, that's it. Um, if there's any other kind of, um, if there's any other kind of, 
uh short form funny rpgs that people can think of please let me know you know uh, post them in the comments below um i'd love to see them um but yeah just as a as a writing exercise shit post i i just i thought this was entertaining this this made my day when i saw it um and uh yeah i'll uh see you on the next one uh you'll be good to each other